export is basically a path address of element. So I have a test setup over here, a blank test without any steps to show you what is export. So let's say my intention here is to uh, navigate to the application. After that, I will click on uh, reviews tab. Okay, so that is, let's say I want to accomplish. So for that, I need a driver to navigate. So before doing anything, let me get the driver and we can get the driver from UI dot get selenium driver. This is the easy way to get started with the more you'll work with us, you'll see we don't use driver like this. But here we have driver. And using this driver, I want to navigate to this application. So I will use get method and I will give the address of our application, which is QA environment application address. This here. Now you will see the use of expert. With this line, we can navigate to an application. So we will end up here. Now our intention here to click on this reviews. So this is what you have to do in application. You probably have to click on a certain element. You probably have to write on certain element. You probably have to read something from an element. So basically whatever you do, you have to interact with element. And driver need element information to interact with. We call it locator. I mean, how a driver can locate the element that you want and many different way we can locate an element using ID of the element. Every element that you see here have those information. Some may have, some not, but typically element can have a ID, can have class name, can have name, tag name always have, can have expert, can have CSS selector to identify those element. Now here, our purpose is to click on reviews button so I need expert of this button. And to get the expert of this button or in fact any element, it's easy. We have to right click on the element that we want to interact with. Then we click on inspect. Then we copy expert from the developer tool that opened. Look, this is highlighted indicating this, this line is this element. So I can right click and copy and copy export and export is copied. We can now use this export for our driver to identify this element. And to do this, we use driver dot find element by dot export and give the export that we copied from the browser, which is this quite long which is why we are not going to use the browser generated expert. We'll write our own expert. You'll learn how to use it. But anyway, now we'll continue with browser generated expert that it gave. In the end, I want to click on this element. So I'll end this statement. So this is the expert that you need, okay? You need expert information to interact with element. We'll continue this script on next lecture.